I'm very happy to have been recognized at last because I think, I mean, I was also surprised that uh, I managed to walk away with the Football of the Year because what surprised me is throughout the season, I never even won one man of the match. But uh, to be recognized as the best player in the PSL, I mean, I'm so humble and I'm so happy and excited at the same time because my hard work has gone unnoticed and yeah thank you very much to everyone who voted and even to the judges judging panel i know maybe it might have been difficult for everyone <coughs> to give it to me but uh, you you guys have your own reasons why you chose me but uh, yeah thank you very much for that and i think i have a bigger challenge next season to defend all the trophies all the hours that i won this season i mean this season it's nothing but a tougher one it's next season because all eyes will be on me to defend all the awards it does but uh, again i think pressure it's always there whether you playing or not whether you on or off the field pressure is always there and i think for me i've handled pressure very well in the past because i have a great support outside the field and even my teammates have always been there coaching staff everybody at the village parents family and uh, my, i mean my my business manager has always been there so i think i'll be able to handle pressure very well i think the attitude and the maturity i think i'm maturing as a player and it's really starting to show now that uh, because i hear that goalkeepers start maturing at the age of 28 and i think for me i'm starting to mature at the age of 26 and i mean that's a great sign and it shows that i have a lot to work on and i have a lot to achieve going forward if i can just keep my feet firmly on the ground and work as harder as i did in the past six seven seasons it has been outstanding not only for us but for the for the national team and i think the rewards the rewards that he's been given tonight and the uh, and the recognition is recognition of a job well done all year both for kaiser chiefs and for the national team and his reputation has grown and his reputation has grown to the point where people see him as being probably the the face of South African football a little bit at the moment, internationally. You know, people talk about foreign clubs are looking at him and he pulls off fantastic saves for Bafana and then he, he keeps us in a game. And, in, and I think his reputation has, uh, has grown greatly. So, yeah, it is unusual, but I think it's quite, it's quite natural. It's probably quite a natural path. Any honour that the club gains uh, to enhance the reputation of the club is, is fantastic and we should all be proud of it. I think the players being uh, given honours and, and me receiving an award, it's just, a, it's just really a receipt that we are doing something okay. You know, you keep going, you, you've got to keep going. Things don't, things don't ever get any easier. You know, you have to keep on working, you have to keep on getting better. And that's what I'll try to do. It's nice, it's nice to get this reward, but you have to keep going. It's, it doesn't mean that that's the end of the story, and it doesn't mean that, that you're perfect in any way, shape or form. We all have to keep working hard.